Hello everyone, this is CBGS, it's me, Leon, and today I bring you the unboxing for BS45, Revival of the Ultimate Gods. So for this set, the boosting is mostly focused towards the blue, green, and yellow. With blue and yellow focusing towards the ultimate, while green is focused towards the blade B side of the entire boost, while red, purple, and white gets touch up uh, boosting as well, with some of the cards that's full arms to the next upcoming set, 46. So with this box, uh, let's just have a quick look at how it looks like. Well, the box is very yellow despite that, uh, I know it's an ultimate box, but this is very yellow. It's full of yellow stuff. Very dirty things inside. <laughs> Very costly to money. So, okay, so uh, the, here are the sites for the information like uh, what is contained within the box itself, and as well as the contact number you need to call to Japan. I don't think it actually matters. And also, as well as the back here with the barcodes, as well as some of the nice art at the bottom, which if you want to make a deck box out of this, it's also fine. Okay, next, let's look at the packaging inside for the packs itself. The box topper Alex, which normally would have cost you easily $50. <laughs> But this one, uh, this is a cheaper version, so you don't have to worry about it. Okay, we get one Alex. Side burst, as well as let us look at the booster packaging itself. Also very shiny, quite nicely packed, very outstanding looking. So I mean, it is an ultimate um, focused pack, so no reason why it should not be this fancy. So okay, with that said, let us jump straight into the unboxing, and I will see you in just a short moment. Come on, I'll talk to you in a while. See what I get. First X-ray out. Oh, I just realized. The yellow X-ray. Oh, the yellow X-ray. This is actually my first copy. I got another X-ray. The the more infamous uh dragon shortcut that literally ignores cannot be destroyed effects. Very nice stuff. Oh, oh! I actually got the the ten and the ten X. But I don't think anyone's gonna use this though. <laughs> I caught me price later. <laughs> okay, so with that, uh, with all the other cards out of the way, this are uh, we just decided to go through the X Ray loan itself because these are the ones that people really want to know. And for the rest, you can always just check out our World of Cards. All the rest of the details for the set is also indicated there. So let's begin right away with the first card here, the red card, the Archer of Dragon Star, Lucas. Okay, on level 1, uh, this is a cost 6 card, right? Okay. For level 1, 2, and 3, Super Boost. When this spirit is summoned, add 3 costs from the Void to all of your Grand Walker Nexus with only color red. This effect can only be used once per game. Next, level 1, 2, and 3, Dragon Shot. When this spirit is summoned, destroy one opposing spirit or ultimate of 20k BP or lower. This BP destruction effect cannot be guarded by any effects. Lastly, level three, this spirit attacks. Activate this spirit's dragon shot. So basically, this is a very, uh, this is a very very powerful card where, on summon, once per game you can call charge all of your grand, red grand walker nexus so that to bring up bring them up to grand field as soon as possible. At the same time, his Dragon Shot is also the one and only so far that has been released that, that bypasses all cannot be destroyed effects. So basically things like Metal Garumon that cannot be destroyed by card effects or even Magnamon on some cases. Yeah, I like to use Digimons on examples. Yeah. Yeah, I think basically things that negates are even armors. Then lastly, for the for his level 3, it's just to allow you to consistently use Dragon Shot every single time when he attacks. So making this card a very devastating card to deal with. Next, uh, next in line is the uh, purple X ray. This is the underworld god uh, Desfimion. Is that how you pronounce it? Desfimion. I don't know if that's French, but okay. So basically, uh, this is a pretty heavy card as well. It's cost nine, uh, and he has three symbols. Oh no. Okay. For effect, when summoning this card, all your spirit contains the name the Seven Shogun gains one additional purple symbol. Oh. Okay, for the level 1, 2, and 3, when this spirit is summoned, attacks. All attacks, okay? During this uh, turn, this spirit, color, and symbol is treated as colorless. And the level cost of opposing spirit or ultimate is plus 3. Whoa. Okay, lastly, level 2 and 3, during your attack step. Your spirit from the family Ogre Wizard, Dark Snake, Infernal Lord, 
attacks, send one uh, call from opposing uh, spirit, ultimate, Grand Walker, ne to, uh, Nexus to the Void. So this is, a, whoa, this is a very powerful card. It helps to boost for Inferno Lord as well, interesting. So basically the idea of this card is supposed to uh, disrupt your opponent field entirely, not just by removing cost but increasing the cost for the opponent's uh, spirit and ultimate. Uh, let's say they are like level 1, it requires 1, it becomes 4. So basically it's a potential bot wipe. So making this card very very powerful as well. Then moving on to one of the most sought out cards for this set will be the yellow ultimate over here. The Astro, uh, the Astro Angelica Goddess uh, Ishtar. The summoning if uh, condition is uh, your, when your life is six or lower. Release, uh, release on two level, three, four, five. When this ultimate attacks, send two calls from uh, your yellow Grand Walker Nexus or one call from your life to this ultimate. Then send two opposing spirit back to your opponent's hand and send one call from your opponent's life to trash. Whoa. Okay. The next uh, four and five. During your attack step, when your life is reduced, this uh, this ultimate refreshes. So basically, the idea of the uh, of this card is that you're supposed to most for most cases you're supposed to take it from life. You take your life and add it to here and to this ultimate, and then it refreshes from there because when your life is reduced. So let's yellow plays. Uh, for this entire set, it's mostly towards life gain rather than spells. So they're supposed to combo your way up to a lot of life and then drop this card down and then go on an attacking spree. Of course, do note that the uh, summoning condition is 6 or lower. So if let's say you have life above that, you cannot do what you should do. Otherwise, it will be quite broken for this card. And lastly, let's look at the, one of the three 10x of the set. The tri Deity Dragon. This one. This is an interesting one. Okay, the Ultimate God King. Uh, Mugen Cho, uh, Chocolan Dragon. Why does it have such an interesting name? Okay, for the summoning condition for this ultimate is that when you have one or more Grand Walker Nexus with six colors, it's a colored uh, type focus Grand uh, Ultimate. Okay, for the ultimate trigger, level three, four, five, six. Okay, when this uh, ultimate attacks, when the ultimate trigger hits, you may pay one cost and summon one ultimate card from your hand after the ultimate trigger in addition. If your life is three or less, move to its X U trigger, X ultimate trigger. Okay, for its X ultimate trigger, when the X U trigger hits, this ultimate, this ultimate gains two additional ultimate symbols and it refreshes. For ultimate trigger, send one card from the top of your opponent's deck to the trash. If the cost of that card is lower than this rate, it will hit. So basically, that's what ultimate trigger does. So basically, you, uh, you look at the top of your opponent, uh, you trash one card from your opponent's deck. If the cost is lower than this uh, ultimate, that is considered a hit and you can proceed to use its abilities. It's also one of the interesting cards that uh, I myself, I don't play ultimate yet so far and I feel there's, there's a lot of potential in this. Just now the question is how we're gonna put it together with all these new, new cards from the set of 45. Okay, now uh, with that said, this is all the uh, cards I showed to you. If you wish to see more, do remember to visit World of Cards. But the rest of the details for the entire set is all that, including the other extras or comments that you'll be seeking out for will also can be found there. Okay, with that said, do follow us on all our, so all our socials like our Twitter, uh, our Facebook, as well as Discord. We'll be there on most nights and you can chit chat with us and find out for more strategy for better spirits and what so and whatnot, or you just want to chit chat and that's fine too. Okay, but with that said, uh, thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!